Hello! So today in this video, you're gonna learn how to pronounce batter and butter. So these are actually pretty different in American English, but for a lot of English learners, for example, for Japanese, we pronounce them in the same way, which is bata, right? So today you're gonna learn how to pronounce this one and this one differently. Okay, so this one, B-A-T-T-E-R, this is like tempura batter, like the stuff that you put uh, around the tempura when you make it, that's called batter. Also, in baseball, the person who um, bats, um, so he's called a batter, so it's same word. So this is batter. And butter, B-U-T-T-E-R, this is made of milk, and uh, that's the stuff that you put on bread. Okay, so this is butter. So let's look at the vowels, because the vowels are actually really different. So for this one, batter, the vowel is this one. The symbol is this one. It's between the A and the E, looks like it. And it actually sounds kind of like between the A and the E. So how to do it is you want to make your mouth kind of triangle shape, and then move your lips sideways, and move it, like open your mouth. So you make triangle shape, and make sure that your tongue is flat. And this is called a flat A. That's because your tongue becomes flat so that you can see your tongue. Eh. 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 Okay, how is it? And for this one, B-U-T-T-E-R. So the vowel is called shua, which is really important in American English because you're going to see this vowel everywhere it's most used vowel and uh, the pronunciation symbol you there are actually two and this one is like upside down v that's when you have a stress on the syllable so for this one butter this one is used for right here this syllable and if you don't have a stress on the syllable and this one is used. So both are called shua, and it sounds like uh, uh, okay? So this is actually really different from uh, Japanese a. Uh. Okay, so Japanese a uh is a, uh, a, uh. okay? And the American shua is uh, uh. So for this one, you want to have uh, all the parts of your mouth very neutral so you don't want to tense your lips or tongue you just want to open your mouth very slightly and then pronounce it and then talk um, try to produce the sound from your diaphragm and then make sure your throat is open uh uh so that is american shua uh uh and then this one butter butter okay so let's go back to this one this one is pronounced batter batter and this one is butter butter okay so for this one you since you open your mouth wider than schwa the, the vowel here is much longer than the schwa sound. So please listen to uh, make sure that the, um, you know the length of the vowel. So this one is longer. Batter. Batter. And this one is shorter. Butter. Butter. Okay, so how is it? Please let me know how it goes. And if you have any questions about pronunciation, please let me know you can comment below and make sure to subscribe if you have the if you haven't done so and a lot of videos are coming up and i'm writing newsletter every week and if you sign up for my newsletter this month you're gonna receive um, newsletters about the differences between japanese and english
pronunciation wise so make sure to sign up for my newsletter and subscribe my channel thank you very much for watching and i'll see you guys later bye